Well, what is happening, all you awesome fishing friends? I am on my way to do some pond hopping today. Not as warm as it was the other day. We're gonna go ahead and try a day with just finesse jigs. I have a lot of people ask, Debo, what jig do you throw? I hate jigs, I don't really throw jigs, I don't have any confidence in jigs. So, today we're gonna throw a finesse jig and see if we can get any bites. Now, I know a lot of people are gonna say, Debo, throwing a finesse jig's easy. Of course you can get bites on a finesse jig. Well, we shall see, and actually that's the point. I wanna get bites on a finesse jig tonight to show folks, if you don't have any confidence in the, in the jig, try throwing a finesse jig. See how long it takes. I only brought the uh, the spinning combo really to throw. I brought a couple other things in case I move, but I got out much, much, much later tonight than I thought I was gonna. I've only got about an hour to fish, so we're gonna see if we can find a couple fish on the old finesse jig. There is a nibble. Felt like a nibble. Come on, finesse jig. There it is. Ooh, there we go. First cast. How about that? If you do not believe in the jig, first cast on the old finesse jig, and we are already hooked up, folks. It does not get any better than that. That's that little Z-Man shroom head. Ooh, he's trying to throw it, and it will keep those babies pinned. As I say that, he's probably gonna break off. This is light line. This is 10 pound braid to a six pound liter. All right, grabbing it by the braid. Don't want to break that line. There we go. First one of the night, first cast. What did I tell you folks? He's not huge, he's a little two pounder. I'll take a day full of two pounders like that on that little Z-Man Craw Finesse Jig. First cast, I'm telling y'all, they do work. Finesse Shroom Jig with that little Z-Man TRD Craw on back. I had a bunch of people ask about that. There it is, first fish of the night on the jig. Get out here, little fella. Nope. Gave us a little shower. But I've got the same plan in mind. I'm still going to be fishing that little Z-Man finesse shroom jig with a little craw on back. Maybe we'll switch up the trailers too to something else I really like on finesse jigs. But let's see. It's going to be a little morning of finesse jigs. See what we can get. we got a bunch of cloud cover. Hopefully it stays. It's only supposed to be about 50 today. But who cares? I want to get out and do some fishing. i got ponds that need to be fished. So let's go. All right, well, unfortunately, my outing out here the other night got cut short. Yeah, the old lady had plans, so that meant I had plans. All you married cats know how that goes out there. Definitely not as nice and warm today as it was the other day. A little windy, but we do have just a little bit of cloud cover. Hopefully, there's a few bass over here chomping on the old finesse jig. Still throwing the same little Z-Man finesse jig. We'll see if we can figure at least a couple fish out. Nothing too crazy. Just going to fish it slow. Had a big cold streak go through. It was 70 the other day and it's back down to 40 today in a few days time. So, I don't know. Maybe the fish are all asleep and they don't want to eat. Hopefully, hopefully we will figure a couple out. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I've been working it super slow and I thought, you know what? I wonder if these fish are going to want to move in just a little bit faster. Sped it up and that fish hit it and that feels like a good fish. Oh, first fish of the day and that is a good fish. Oh my goodness. That's probably my biggest fish of the year on a little finesse jig. Holy crap. Stay pinned. Come on, little finesse jig. Keep him pinned. Going super slow this whole time. Sped it up and just started barely, barely reeling and crawling it on the bottom. He smacked it and that's a good fish. Oh my gosh, y'all, this is why you throw the finesse jigs right now when it's still chilly, do not throw that hook. Oh my gosh, that is, that is a good fish. That's the biggest one of the year. Oh, got her. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? Are you freaking kidding? On the little finesse jig. Look at that. 
on the finesse jig big old fat mama no flipping way Ugh. all right let's get a weight on this big girl i think she'll probably go four and a half let's see this is definitely my biggest fish of the year there's that little finesse jig kept her super pin right behind the bone of that jaw all right let's see what we got this is the first fish of the day just after i decided to speed it up a little bit uh, almost okay just over four four ten decided we weigh her chunky chunky old girl right there how about that how about that for first fish of the day just over four and a half pounds on that little z-man jig let's let this big mama go all right here you go big girl get out and get after it come on you're free and there she goes i was taking this little finesse jig and moving it real 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 slow i just started barely reeling it on the bottom a little bit quicker and she hit it all right this water's pretty darn dirty i'm gonna make one adjustment see if this makes any sort of difference i'm gonna take off the little z-man craw as much as i like it take him off do i have that where's my craw thing there it is put it in the package Here's one little secret I will show you all for these little finesse jigs. I want to take one of these. This is one of my Grande Bass air tails. It's similar to, you know, just a zoom trick worm. Except these have a little tail that floats. So I'm going to take just that tail off. I want it hanging off just a little bit about like that. So I'm going to cut it to there. I'm actually going to use that tail as my trailer. You can save that. You can Nico rig that, throw that weightless, whatever you want to do. Let's switch this up, see if this makes any difference. A little bit darker tail, give a little outline. See if I can draw a few more fish in. This water's pretty dirty. That craw trailer was not, not very dark. Let's try that. See if that brings anything in. There we go. Had to make a little move. Went through a little drought there. Finally, we caught another one. All right, on the old finesse jig. About 15 minutes, I gotta go, so. Been out here for about 45 minutes. This is only the second fish, but another, another decent feeling fish. Yeah, the little old finesse jig. Doing some work for me here. All right, let's go. Oh, that's a decent fish. That's like probably a two pounder. Oh, pin right in the side. Yeah, we'll take a bunch of those. Not a two pounder, a little pound and a half or ooh. Just barely had him by the skin of his. Look at that guy though. He's been eating, huh? Let's see if we can get a few more. Let go. All right, we'll let this guy go here. All right, little fella, get out there and grow to be a five pounder. Off he goes. All right, so that's two on the old finesse jig. Just made up that little change, put the Grande Bass Airtail on there. It's black, I wanted it to give a little bit more of an outline, so. See if I can pick a few more up over here. Second one on the old finesse jig. Can we find a few more? Got him. I thought I felt something pecking it down there. Yes, sir, another one. Let's go, let's go. Couple more casts before I decided I was gonna go. Sure enough, hooked another, ooh, that's a decent fish. Yeah, that's another decent one. Two something pounder probably. There we go. Yeah, the old crawl doing some work. Looks like he's hooked pretty well. Only on six pound liter though, so I don't wanna horse him. Let's just bring him close. Just like so, got him. All right, another good fish. Another two pounder on the day. It's been interesting, the bite that they've wanted is just me slowly, slowly creeping this, reeling this on the bottom. Another little two pound chunk, I'll take those all day, but very interesting. They don't want it just sitting, not doing anything. They don't want it hopping. They just want it crawled extremely slow on the bottom. Another one out. Thought I felt him pecking at it. I moved down just a little bit farther. Only got a couple minutes before I got to leave. 
I know I said that like 15 minutes ago, but it might be just over an hour, but who cares? Move down just a little bit farther to see if I can get one more, another little two pound chunk on a little finesse jig. Again, that was after I made that slight change up and put that Grande Bass air tail on the back. Wanted a little bit of dark plastic to make a little silhouette back there. Everything else was kind of that green pumpkin sort of see-through with that Z-Man craw. So I want to go a little darker. One more, one more cast. All right, fishing friends, I gotta get out of here. At least we caught a few today. I'll take it. Hopefully we can catch some more of them. I gotta get going. I stayed out a little bit past my hour, but that's all right. We caught some fish, so it was well worth it. But I gotta get going. My camera's going all over. So until next time.